girl Judy. Today it's spaghetti. Spaghetti. Really good spaghetti. I'm not going to put any sausage in it. I was going to buy a pack of sausage to put in it, but I didn't. So I'm going to uh, do just plain ground beef spaghetti. You'll need a bell pepper. Two onions. I like an onion, a lot of onions in my spaghetti. The spaghetti noodle. Rotel hot diced tomatoes. And they got the habaneros in them, so it's going to be spicy. Dice, hunch diced tomatoes. Ragu, ragu. Old world style sauce. And I got a traditional one. And I got a garlic, roasted garlic one. And we're going to need some garlic bread. I'm going to put a little something extra special on here. Like a little bit more cheese and another uh, sauce I'm going to put on top of this and stick it in the oven. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and get my bell peppers. And my onions cut up. And uh, get my ground beef in the pot and get it ground up. How y'all doing? How you doing? And I will be right back. Oh, no. I want to dedicate this spaghetti uh, dinner that we're having to the ladies up at uh, Affordable Affordable Dentures. I want to dedicate it to them. Uh, they subscribed to my uh, channel. So I told them I would come. One lady asked me to fix spaghetti. I don't know their names or her name, but she knows who I'm talking about. It's in Pell City. They all work in Pell City, in the Pell City, Alabama area. And I'm going to dedicate my spaghetti uh, recipe to you. She knows who I'm talking about. Okay, I'll be right back. And plus, they gave me my smile back. I'll be right back. Okay, at the moment I'm cutting my onions and bell peppers up. And, and remember, you don't have to cut them up so small. You want to taste them. So you want to get them sort of like medium size. Not small, not tiny, but you want to get them medium size. You want to taste the vegetables in the uh, spaghetti. And uh, I forgot to introduce my flavors when I uh, started my video out. And uh, the, what we're putting in the uh, spaghetti is Italian herbs. Italian, let that light go again. Italian herbs. Lari seasoning salt. Onion powder. Accent. Garlic powder. Black pepper. Yeah, you don't have to chop your uh, bell peppers and onions up so small. You can uh, sort of do them in a medium size. And uh, right now, I'm getting them all chopped up. And I'm going to start the ground beef in just a second.
I decided I wasn't going to put two onions in. I reached in the refrigerator and I saw a onion that had been cut up, cut on. So I got that out. So I'm thinking maybe one and a half onion would be good. Okay, now I'm going to go over here and put my ground beef in. Excuse me, baby. Excuse me. Okay. Okay. Turn on high. Excuse me, and don't do that no more. Don't you do that no more. Excuse me. Say, excuse me. Okay. Breaking it up a little bit. I'm going to turn this light off. Onion and put my onion and bell pepper in because I wanted to cook with my meat. I don't want to cook before at or after my meat. I want to cook it with my meat. Mm-hmm. Yes, Colin. You see, they're pretty big, big pieces. They're not little tiny pieces. Seasonings in. About a tablespoon of onion powder. About a teaspoon of, of well, I'm gonna say a tablespoon because it's it, I, I put a pretty big roll size roll in here. So I'm gonna go with a tablespoon of accent. I'm gonna go with a tablespoon of just about everything. Italian herbs. About a tablespoon. Huh? Okay, I'm going to put a tablespoon of black pepper, black pepper, and I think I got some already opened up up here, I do, about a tablespoon, I'm going to use it all up, it was about a tablespoon, you done, okay, about a tablespoon of garlic powder. And for the salt, I'm going to go in with the little Lowry's. I'm going to do about one tablespoon of Lowry's. Now for my noodle over here, I'm going to go in with a tablespoon of butter. What, baby? Put it 
trash can. And about a tablespoon of salt. And I'm gonna let this come up to a high boil. As soon as the butter melt, then I'm gonna put my noodles in. My meat, I'm gonna ground it all up and I'll be right back with you. Okay, now I am putting my noodle in. The water has come to a real quick boil. And I'm gonna keep the spaghetti noodle long because the Chinese say, long noodle, long life. Even though it's not Chinese food. Long noodle, long life. Okay? And as you can see, I am still grounding on my ground beef. So, I'm going to go away and get it all ground up. Okay, as you see, my noodles are, ooh, I splattered. My noodles are beginning to get uh, done. I used to thin spaghetti Rally! Hush. Hush, Riley. Right. My noodles, I used to thin noodles. And uh, I'm going to ground, strain, strain. I'm going to strain my ground beef. And I put a little red bowl underneath so I can catch the grease because the grease isn't good for our drainage. So, now I'm getting ready to strain. Strain it. Okay, and I'm gonna use the same pot to put it right back. Okay, as you can see, I'm through with the ground beef and the onions. And they're chopped up really big. The, the bell peppers and onions are chopped up really big. And uh, I'm going to transfer throw them in my pot over here. Okay, now I'm going to do my bread and I'm going to put you right over here. I'm cooking stuff. Y'all know y'all get something. I'm get y'all. Come on. Y'all know y'all weapon. I ain't got to steal it. Okay. Now I'm putting mayonnaise. Now I ain't have some this weekend. I ain't have some this weekend. We got a little company, as y'all can tell. Hey, uh, uh, cool bread. And uh, I used to put bread, mayonnaise on my it's grilled cool cheese. Bread. And this is where I get it from. I love mayonnaise on my grilled cheese. So I'm going to put a little mayonnaise here. Okay, I'm spreading a little mayonnaise. They got a little loud. And I had about a half a, tea, uh, half of a cup of mayonnaise on one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pieces of bread. And I'm going to use it all up. Okay. 
Now I'm gonna do the grill or uh, put the cheese on it. You can use white cheese, uh, Swiss cheese, uh, mozzarella cheese. You can use any kind of cheese you want. I'm using the mild cheddar shredded cheese. And uh, it's my preference. You know, that's what I always say. It, you, you can do whatever you want. And I'm going to let it sit for a minute until I get my spaghetti mixed up. I'm going to put you on this side of town. And mix my spaghetti up. The noodles are already ready. They boil for about maybe 15 minutes. About 15, 20 minutes. Okay, there you go. Noodles are ready. 15, 20 minutes. Okay. Now I'm start. I'm going to put my sauce in. My tomatoes first. The Rotel diced tomatoes. I'm putting my tomatoes in. Hey, you get out the way, Scott. Get out the way. Where did it come from? I don't know what that is. Oh, out of that flower pot. Yep. Okay, let me go away for a minute. Lance's mother passed away last Friday. And uh, we're having some company to come in and uh, check on him. So that's why everything is loud and Confucius. So uh, and they'll be burying her this coming Saturday, uh, which is, um, let me see, today is the... 19th so what is Saturday y'all uh, today is the 19th which is Tuesday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday 19 20 uh, the 23rd of November 2019 will be her burial um, she did turn 80 on her birthday the 9th and uh, she passed away five days, five days after her birthday. So we're having a little company, and uh, I'm sorry it's a little loud, but uh, I'll be right back with you. I'm going to go away and open up my cans and, and place them in my spaghetti. So I will be right back. Colin, please. Okay, I'm back. I've already put the Rotel tomatoes in the spaghetti, and... Uh, I am going to put the Hunt's diced tomatoes in. Ragu tomato sauce. The traditional. I'm going to put a little water in and shake it around. Roasted garlic. Stirring it up. And I 
think I want some uh, mushrooms in here. Just a minute. And I'm going to drain them off. Okay. I got everything in here except for this uh, Italian sausage. And the kitchen sink. Okay. Now I'm gonna taste it to see what it what it's lacking. Lacking a lot of stuff. The garlic powder. I'm going to go back in with another tablespoon of garlic powder. And it's not salt, so the powder is good, you know. Another tablespoon of uh, Italian. Mm -mm. Italian herbs. I'm going to just shake it in there. Accent. About a half teaspoon, half half tablespoon. Salt. About two tablespoons. And a little bit more larvas. I guess y'all say I'm going with the salt, but it's it's not seasoned good. And I like mine seasoned. I don't like to have to fix my food. And then shake salt or pepper. So, just to your preference again. And I opened up an extra can. Of, uh, where is it? Oh, here it is. Tomato sauce. Pasta sauce. Traditional. I'm going to put it in here because I like a lot of sauce on my spaghetti. Um, I don't like a dry spaghetti. I like a lot of sauce on it. And, uh, oh, yeah, it's getting where I like it. I haven't tasted it yet, but it's it's getting there now. Okay. Okay. Now let me see what it tastes like. That's better. And even though I added the seasoning salt, the lorries, and the uh, accent, because it wakes up the flavor, and the salt, it's not salty. It really is not salty. It's um, It's got a better flavor to it. So I'm going to bring it to a good boil, and I'll be right back. Okay. One thing I forgot. I've got to start writing these things down. I forgot to put parsley flakes. About a tablespoon of parsley flakes. And and the most important thing 
is the basil leaves. Basil leaves, it makes spaghetti taste so good. Basil leaves. I'm gonna put about a. I'm gonna put about a tablespoon. And I put about three tablespoons of sugar. It's a lot of ground beef, so it's not a lot of sugar. Uh, or either you can add brown sugar. It gives it that. It gives it that sweet basil taste. Even though you're putting basil in here, it gives it that sweet, not really sweet. It gives it, it breaks away from that, that ground beef flavor. I, I can't explain it, but try it. And I'm going to stir it around with the basil and the parsley and the sugar. Because just regular without sugar, it's got a wane to it. And uh, I can't really explain it, but but trust me. Okay. And it's not gonna be too sweet. It's gonna it's gonna level off the flavor. And it's not sweet enough, really. It's not got that taste. So I'm going to put about another tablespoon of sugar. And like I said, you can put brown sugar in here. Brown sugar is better than uh, plain white sugar, granulated sugar. Brown sugar is better. Okay, let me try it again. Okay, that's good. That's good. Uh, I'm gonna go away and come back. Listen, y'all. I had made my spaghetti up and showed y'all the finishing results, and uh, the video wasn't on. But uh, this is some really good spaghetti. And uh, I'm gonna give it another good taste. And it's really good, but it's not seasoned enough. Maybe I should have used garlic salt instead of garlic powder. I like my food to be real seasoned. Now I'm going to have to add some more salt on this <laughs> as I'm eating. And uh, it's just not seasoned enough for me. And my battery going low, so I want to go ahead and say what I got to say. Oh, wait a minute. Let me let Skylar taste it. I'm going to taste the meat too. I'm going to taste the meat too? Yeah. I'm going to taste meat too. Okay. Mm. Set the noodles up. <laughs> like Lady and the Tramp. <laughs> okay. Now I'm going to let Sky, uh, Colin taste it. Oh. There we go. Is it good? Do I get a thumbs up? Do I get a thumbs up? Okay. Okay, let me tell y'all something else. And the scripture button. Turn me out of the road and look at it again. Okay, baby. You sit over there. Okay. Let me move back. I am so sorry that my husband said the n-word on my channel i don't use that word i don't appreciate that word 
You know when a lot of men get together and a lot of black men, they use that word. So, you can't, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. And um, I am so, so very sorry my husband used that word on my channel. Okay? So, with that being said, subscribe, like, and comment to my video. Be humble. Stay blessed. And y'all have a good day. Y'all ain't got to go home. But you got to get out of here. Bye for now.